Another setback in Old Bisbee, which is trying to recover from a devastating fire last month. That recovery is being delayed yet again after a wall in the burned buildings came crashing down. 13 News reporter Katherine Patterson went to Bisbee today to speak with city officials on their mission to restore that part of town. The city of Bisbee has been dealing with more and more obstacles when it comes to getting things back to the way they were since this fire. But they say they're looking at the silver lining. The sidewalk is back open. Fixing up these buildings has come with a lot of unexpected turns. The first four weeks was everything I can do to try to save the bricks and the facades that were there. Everybody kept telling me, no, sorry, Mayor. These things have been too compromised. You're going to put other things at risk. It's going to cost you twice as much money, blah, blah, blah. And so finally, we went ahead and, and went with Plan B. Most recently with the building right next door to the original damage. The wall had also been ruined by the fire and collapsed yesterday. While this additional damage doesn't add any struggle to the city construction, the privately owned building may require the construction on Main Street to stay a while longer. You know, you feel like you're two steps forward, another one back. And and reality is when you deal with these older buildings um, and you have a devastating fire that affects walls and all the other things that go on, until you get into the nuts and bolts, it's a very fluid situation. So but the recently opened sidewalk is giving businesses in the area a spark of hope. You know, I came out and I was just like, wow, yay, you know, like really excited because that means that now we can finally get some good traffic going through. And they're hoping it will make things easier for visitors and customers during their busy season. Walk all over Bisbee, you know, and so that's just really crucial to us, um, to our economy, you know, in Bisbee, you know, keeping these businesses going, keeping customers coming in and out. The mayor tells me that they're planning on beginning the investigation as to what exactly caused the fire beginning next week. Reporting in Bisbee, Katherine Patterson, 13 News.